Hey Collectors, it's chatting with you and I am back with another video. What's good? Good morning. It's literally 6.33 a.m. right now. I'm up. All right, so let's do some energy. Let's see what's going on. What do the collective need to see? You got brown skin girl playing on um the TV. So I feel like you could be a um a melanated female. I feel like you're very beautiful. Like your skin glows like and I feel like you're somebody who you gl glow naturally but now you have this happy glow. And I feel like a lot of people don't like it. Okay, that's the energy that I'm getting. Okay, you got undercover, cold CPS on you, recovering from the magic. So I feel like somebody was undercover watching you. Okay. They were really like disguising themselves. This could have been some, I feel like this is somebody who was very close to you. And they played you very, very close, you know? And they used, you know, whatever they saw against you when they called CPS, that's what I'm getting. You know, they, I feel like they lied. You know, they lied, they added shit on. But this is somebody who was close to you. And every, this person used to watch everything you do. They was putting magic on you. You could have been suffering from headaches. I'm getting that somebody could have had a headache or could have been suffering from headaches. Yeah, I'm speaking to an empress. I'm speaking to an empress. And it's like whoever you had a fucking baby by, they weren't shit. They were not shit. This person knew what was going on. But it's like you could have been suffering from headaches, right? And I feel like it was due to the magic that they were putting on you that's crazy because you got cheap girls on i heard somebody was they was paying for cheap spells like that's why the way the shit is backfiring it's crazy they was doing like mediocre spells is what i'm hearing but you could have been suffering from like massive headaches and say you know your kids you know and you could have like been under a lot of pressure and was like spazzing they was using that against you somebody that you was venting to you know whatever you were going through i'm telling you you could have been going through baby mama baby daddy drama and it was just like stressing you out on top of them putting magic somebody was happy you could have you was having massive ass headaches but they were putting that on you you're recovering from this though You're recovering from this. Yeah, you have to take a break from outside. Alone is where you hear your thoughts clear. I'm also getting that if it wasn't a baby mama, baby daddy, like it could have been just a masculine energy that you was dealing with. But I'm getting that, yeah. Like, it was a masculine energy, whether it was your baby father or just a man you was dealing with. I'm also getting it for some of you. It could have never been a man you was dealing with. It could have just been somebody that you knew. But I feel like this undercover person is a female. This is somebody that you know you hung out with. They could have kids. Like, this was like maybe a mommy friend or something like that. Or this is what you looked at her as. But she was here to um watch you anyway mm-hmm okay you gotta fuck anything with a dick with a pussy or a dick so this could be yeah somebody's baby father they could have been saying that that's what you do I'm also getting that for some of y'all, this could be, say your baby father was cheating on you with somebody. This could be this female. 
and she could have friended you up and you would have you never knew that she was fucking with him and you could have been venting to her like y'all that's crazy because i was i saw keisha cole um damn trust and believe go watch that video i saw her yesterday mind you i ain't see that video in so long and it was just like wow but go watch that video because this is resonating for somebody yep this could have like i said this is your friend in the video it was her friend he was cheating keisha coleman was cheating with her friend tanya and then somebody name could be tanya somebody name could be keisha but keisha was keisha cole friend i mean keisha was telling her friend tanya like how her man cheat well she didn't know but she had a feeling like shit wasn't right come to find out the same girl that she was venting to he was sleeping with wow This person could act like they love you. They could want to come in and be like, oh, I love you. Like, I'm sorry this happened, blah, blah, blah. For some of y'all, they got this person pregnant. They sure the fuck did. Okay, you got to listen to your child. They giving messages. See, I knew. It was something. I knew what was coming out. Somebody could be a water sign. Okay, you got they, they mad you kept your baby and they kept getting abortions. Yeah, graveyard coochie. Yeah, this person got some sort of grave. This person, look at them sirens. Like, y'all. Confirmation, this reading hitting for somebody. But look how Empress is in the middle of the deck. Baby, you're the Empress. These per these people, I said, if I say these persons, these people cannot fuck with you. I feel like somebody's grandfather spoke like that, like persons and like, I don't even know what is that called. Like, is that, I don't know. But, um, yeah. I'm also getting that, like, I don't know why, but I'm getting like somebody could have been in like a gang, like Bloods or something. Or Crip, I don't know. But I'm picking up blood with this um all this red i feel like when you seen this like when you found this out you saw red but it's like you had to realize but somebody child is telling them this could be going on right now this could be somebody's current life and a child is telling them what's going on listen to that baby listen to that baby i'm hearing a fake friend that's why my friend no, I'm hearing fake, bitch. That's when my friend fucked on your nigga. Damn. You can hang out with this person. This person could love that part of the song real good. And if this, if this friend is not... If the friend didn't directly fuck him, your baby father, or just a man in general. But I feel like it's a kid involved. They're, um... They friended. They somebody they know did. They friend. They family member. Like say your friend put, say your homegirl put her cousin or something on to your man. You know what I'm saying? She not fucking him, but somebody like she got somebody else to do it. Type shit. Yeah, desire. It's like these people desire your life. They want whatever it is that you got. And it's like, it's crazy. Yeah, but they got caught up. Shit, you, I seen New Year's too. So somebody could be getting caught up on New Year's. They could have got caught up in New Year's. If something could have been significant. Something could have happened on New Year's. Ooh, look. What the? Y'all. Y'all. Didn't I say something could have happened on New Year's? Or could happen on New Year's? New Year's is in two weeks, literally. Something could come out. This could be a warning. Or this could have happened this New Year's. I don't know. Like, 2020 New Year's. Yeah, and you caught... Yeah, but balance, caught up. Yeah, see, it's like, wait, you... You you caught... They got caught up, but it's like you caught balance in, into your life. They could have been given money. 
I feel like you got your money up, period. Yeah, with this signs and symbols and performer, somebody is definitely... Yeah, see, this person pretended to be your friend. They was acting like they was for you. They was for your connection. They, 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 <laughs> this bitch funny. Yeah, I can't make it up. But the grass was fake. That bitch was phony. Yeah, confusion. She was trying to confuse you. It's that new line of study. Didn't I say, look with this new line of study, researching the cult things. Didn't I say that um, somebody was doing like mediocre or them? I said somebody was doing mediocre spells. That's why that shit didn't work. That shit was giving you crazy headaches though. <laughs> it was like, what the fuck is this? Like what they thought was gonna happen and didn't happen. I feel like that shit backfired some shit. This person, yeah, show more gratitude because they look oh, I'm getting that they were trying to kill you. Something came to an end though, but they were trying to kill you. And it's like it was just giving you headaches. These people was doing fucking confusion and death spells. They so dumb. It's like they was confused when they was doing this shit. They didn't know what to do. You know how somebody like, um, and then you mix this. And um, how, how much did they say? One tablespoon of this? And, and like, this person was real jittery when they was doing it anyway. Real confused. And that's why the shit didn't work. Like, how they thought it was going to work. I feel like whoever you are, you recover from that shit mad fast, too. Yeah, grow. It's like you grew from that situation. Look, you got bound. Halloween. Something could have happened around Halloween, too. But it's like this person is bound to whatever fucking magic they put on you. Like, why are you playing with some shit you don't know nothing about? I seen the celebrating card, so something could have really been significant about New Year's. Or something could be significant about New Year's. Somebody's birthday could be on New Year's. Yeah, you got arrested and cleansed. Yeah, be mindful because somebody really want to start a fight with you. It's like this person is fucking your man. Or they friend fucking your man, but somebody want to start a fight. Like, if you fucking him, fuck him. Why you collective ain't worried about that nigga? Fuck him. The fuck? That's crazy. The difference between Cardi B and Glorilla Verse and fucking um, Tomorrow is really like divine femme energy versus the verse karmic. Like, and it's not to say I'm not calling Cardi a karmic. I fuck with her, but I'm just saying, like, what Glorilla said. Um, damn, I can't even get the song, but and I love that song. Damn, what she said. Thinking that she got one up on me, she got my hand-me-downs. Made that nigga stand on it, now his ass can't stand me now. But then you hear Cardi come on. Bro, bitch, that's what my friend fucked on your nigga ass. Both y'all bitches perceive. Y'all think y'all should scissor? Like, she was talking, don't get me wrong. But certain shit that she was saying, like, when she said, I'm fighting over, and I'm fighting over dick too. Like, Divine Feminine, you not doing that. Somebody wants you to feel some type of way that they fucked your man. Nigga, he done fucked everybody. Divine Feminine don't give a fuck. And it's crazy because I was picking up on this energy, but I'm like, I'm not going to come up here and like, I'm going to let the cards do the talking and this shit is exactly what's coming out. Like, somebody is mad that they got caught up or they about to get caught up. However it goes, it's like, you don't give a fuck and it's like, they... They thought that they had one up on you doing that. No. Yeah, you got Queen of Wands here. I feel like whoever you are, you look the fuck good. Period. And that's the thing. Like, you, you're like, it's like, all right. And this person could look good too. But that don't take away from you looking good. Period. You not no hating ass bitch. And that's the thing. People be, it be like, damn boo. You, that's crazy. <laughs> but it's like, I don't even know who talk like that. This masculine could talk like that. But, um, it's like, damn, boo, like, I look good, but bitch, you look good, too. That's the type of female that I am. If a bitch look good, I'ma let her know she look fucking good, period. 
I'm not no hating ass bitch. And that don't take away from me looking good either. That's the thing with bitches. Like, bitches be so caught up in their in in insecurities that they see another female who they might, that might have something good. Like, say a, a girl is insecure about her boobs. And then you cool, but you, your boobs look good. She don't like you. And it's like, bitch, you don't even know what type of insecurities that I got. You don't know what I like about you because you just, like, I don't like energies like that. Then they want what you got and all of that to prove a point, to make themselves feel better. But you still have that insecurity when it comes to this empress. The fuck? Yeah, you got queen of swords, page of swords, five of swords. So you could be a fire sign or an air sign. But I feel like, yeah, with this emperor here, it was like somebody was sent to watch you. To do some trickery shit or whatever. But the whole time this person was fucking this man. The fuck? Shit, for some of y'all, he was fucking both of them. Like, both the friends. Like... Like I said, if it wasn't the, your friend and it was like her cousin or something, or it could have been her cousin and a friend, this person, this masculine was very messy, very messy. And he don't even necessarily got to be no emperor, but I feel like that he coming up as that because like he could be and, and he was paying bitches. You don't, I don't know. Yeah, but you got the nine of pinnacles. What's this? Knight of Pentacles, Justice, Judgment. Yeah. This person could have been trying to spy on you when it came to some money. Or just whatever you was doing in general. But I feel like they didn't like you because you were in this Knight of Pentacles energy. You know, just focused on yourself, what you got going on. You don't fuck, you don't bother nobody or deal with nobody. I'm also getting that somebody got a emperor really coming towards them, a real emperor. I'm seeing that. I'm seeing that somebody got somebody real coming towards them because this was some bullshit you was fucking dealing with. That's with this Knight of Pentacles, Justice, Judgment. This is this new energy that's coming in is your justice. That's sick. Like, I hate, I just don't, I'm not gonna say I hate, I just don't like, I don't like females like that. I'm not gonna never be in a bitch face and want her nigga. And even if you don't know the female or whatever, yeah, you got the death card here. Yeah, see, somebody going through, this is the justice. Somebody's going through judgment. And that's just that. The knight of, with the knight of swords and page of cups. Damn, shit could be happening to these people, kids, too. Because you know the page of cups is like children. With this knight of swords. Because they was calling CPS and doing all sorts of shit on you. Fuck out of here. I'm like, wait, why would I? Because I swear. I'm like, wait, why would I say that? Like, I don't talk about people's kids, but that's what I saw with this knight, with this nine of swords. I want y'all to see the cards with this nine of swords and this page of cups. Y'all know, like, this could be a message about love or, like, children, somebody young. This person, this female, is in this nine of swords energy because of things that is going on with her children now. You don't do that. And you don't do that. You don't, you don't, you don't fuck with nobody kids, period. I don't give a fuck what. You don't fuck with nobody kids. Then you smiling up at people's face. Ha, 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 y'all kids all playing together. You fucking a nigga and you calling CPS on her. Because she's stressing about the fact that her nigga is cheating and is with you. Oh, you got some fucking nerve. Yeah, with the grandchildren and the seven of six. I'm telling you, you're, 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 look, I can't make it a big old big mama again. Because I'm like the grandchildren. That's the star energy and this is the sun energy. But you're a star. You and your child. You see how it's, 
it's like ancestors, like a hand here, a hand here. Oh, it's only two, but I felt like I was seeing three hands like over each other, but oh, it's like two, it's two hands. It's a grandmother and then a child. But your ancestors is covering over you, especially you and a baby, they like, come on. You don't do that. Yeah, people was doing a lot of shit. This could have been somebody you was cooking, eating, chilling, drinking with. That's putting shit in your shit. Yeah, but you got the temperance and the and the and the fool. The free man. This person this bitch, she getting her shit. Look, and that's the fucking truth. This bitch getting her shit. You ain't got shit to worry about. Look and then look. Caught in the ace of baskets. Baby, that love coming. That love coming. They just thought they was doing something. Like, <laughs> they thought they was doing something. They wasn't doing shit. Let's get a closing message for the collective. They was not doing shit. Okay, so you got grief, health, and discipline. Okay, it says, I understand that losing something is an opportunity to appreciate it, period. So deal with whatever it is that you're dealing with. I feel like get over, get through that grief, you know? It's okay. It's okay to cry. It's okay to feel fucked up and betrayed because this is some fucked up shit. This, this situation, whoever dealing with this, this is fucked up, period. But it's like your health is more important. I'm hearing if you've been setting goals to lose weight, eat healthier, you know, or just take care of yourself. Because with this grieving, like, somebody, take care of yourself. Some of you may need to eat. This shit could have had you fucked up to the point where you weren't eating or overeating. With this discipline, I could accomplish whatever I set my mind to. Focus on your goals. Focus on what you got going on. And that's crazy. At the bottom of the deck, you got loneliness. I know that I'm never alone. Know that your spirit, guys, is right there with you. You got a grandmother and a great-grandmother who is really not playing with you. People envious of what you have, period. That's all it is. And then I see purpose here. People are mad that you have purpose. You know what I'm saying? Don't worry about people being envious of you. Show your gratitude for what you got because it's like, damn, I got this. And people don't like that. But, you know, I know some of you may like, damn, I don't want nobody to not. But fuck that. Fuck that. That's crazy. So, that's the message that I have for you all. And until next time.